guys, welcome back to my channel and for today's video is going to be unboxing again from Liberex and they sent this one for me to test it out and do a demo for you guys and uh, we'll see if it's going to work out. This time is a different one, it's not a, a skincare tool. This one is the electric makeup brush cleaner set. As you guys can see, here it is and it's really kind for them to send this one for me to test it out for you guys and thank you Librex for this one this is the third time you guys uh sent me a beautiful product to test out and disclaimer a little bit for you guys and this one is not sponsored or uh i didn't get any commission to do this video for you guys it's totally a free one let's go unbox this one with this two paper and it does have a user manual and it does have the register and register your product and get extra 12 months warranty and it does have their website here and how to do it the warranty one for you guys so it's good and this is the uh, manual how to use how to take care of it uh, what are the package content? It's how it looks like inside. So it is really protected. It does have this foam one. And I think this is the handle. Yeah, this is the handle of the uh, brushes, I guess. I don't know. It's the first time for me to do. And this is the. Uh, where you put the water and the soap and whatever uh, cleaning substance you can use for cleaning your brushes, your makeup brushes. And these are the, um, I think this is the where you let it dry your brushes. And then it does have a cleaner too. And lastly is the holder of your brushes. So let's go get the manual and see what are these ones. It includes one electric brush cleaner, which is this one. This one's right here. I think it's the first. Uh, and then it goes fast. So that's the second one. And then uh this is the brush spinner bowl looks like a coffee maker bowl but it's like a a cup or two <laughs> and then next one is the a silicone color stands i think it's this one they're talking about this is this stand and then we have eight rubber holders right here they have different sizes so we have one two three four five six seven eight so we have eight total of the rubber uh rubber holders and we have the uh the charger itself and then i think you charge it right right here I think that's it and then you can just charge it on your you have the box to uh, put it on the wall socket so now we're gonna go try to do this first it says uh, put some water and soap or makeup cleaning shampoo into your bowl and then the second one is uh, find the suitable colors and insert the brush into the spinner and then third press the switch button to turn on the positive rotation press the switch button to reversal press number four press the switch button to turn it off features on this uh, cleaner clockwise and anti-clockwise cleaning mechanism 
clean all size makeup brushes just in a few seconds easy to use three steps to use this brush cleaner assemble the spinner with makeup brush spin and rinse spin to dry it sturdy and durable this the clean bowl is made by high grade materials to ensure the long lasting use and it is non-toxic which is uh, environmental friendly and easy cleaning suit for different sizes makeup brush eight different sizes of rubber holders suit for makeup most of the makeup brushes uh, more neat dressing table you need color stand can effectively place makeup brushes no longer worry about them scattered to anywhere so we're gonna test this out the uh, bowl it does have a silicone to protect this lid of it and this is the brush holder or the rubber holder and this is the brush spinner you can put it right here or if you can want it to be like this while you're charging it so here are the rubber ones that you can put your brushes on and i only have two four six that are meant to be on my brushes um holder and these two they can even uh they can even uh match to my brushes because some of the tip of my brushes are really skinny in here and these four are matches to this one so let's go start using this one i'm gonna take this off this is the cover and then put that aside and this is the one or the brush thing spinner so first i'm going to use this one's right here we're gonna try to put this one here well, hopefully it's not gonna make a mess so now i'm gonna And then we're going to do all the rest of the brushes. Look at it now. This one's much more cleaner. It's much more cleaner. I'm going to show this to you guys again. Look at it. How dirty is this? Then we're gonna do the rest of the brushes. As you guys can see, the um, water is already dirty. You can see it there. Now I'm going to rinse all of these brushes. So now we're gonna rinse them off. We're gonna use these again. I think it's much more easier to do it like after that I'm just gonna rinse it off like all of them at once so this one is much more easier for me to uh, let it dry my makeup brushes instead of like putting it them up so now I'm going to do the honest review for you guys and first of all this 
concept of this electric makeup brush cleaner set it is really admirable it is very exciting to use and it's very fascinating when you see how the brushes are spinning on this bowl like uh, clockwise and counterclockwise and the holder and the color of it is really nice it's pink it's cute and now we're gonna talk about this one this one it's a little bit tricky because you have to charge it after and uh, it's a little bit um, fascinating because while I'm using it I have a little bit of a wet hands or wet situation on the where I wash my brushes so it's a little bit tricky because it's hard to not to put uh, or the water come inside of this socket so be careful on that one if you guys have this one be careful because sometimes you're gonna get electrics electric electric executed if you guys didn't um, let this area dry and then and I think it's because of this side too it's hard because of um, how the brushes are they don't really go all the way so they just stop right there which is uh, when you put this rubber with the brush in here it's a little bit wimpy like wimpy when you uh, turn it on it's like a little bit uh, winky and I think it's because of how the shape of the bowl is to manage it like do it like this or move more it down or a little bit more higher I get that one but it's a little bit limpy I guess so and then for the size of the rubber rubber brushes holder or whatever you call this ones uh, they don't match on my uh, the tip or the uh, end of my brushes because of this two they are too big and some of them are too tight and I feel like my brushes are going to get destroyed whenever I pull them out and I'm really like a little bit peaky when it comes to my brushes my makeup brushes because they are my I go to brushes whenever I do my makeup on for rinsing it's a little bit tricky too because it doesn't rinse the brushes at all it's much more easier to just put the uh, brush under the sink and wash it off with your hands and then take it off the bubbles or the oil of it and then uh, use a paper towel to uh, wet, uh, dry them up a little bit and then put it in the towel as you guys uh, see I put it in there and I don't put my whenever I rinse or wash my brushes I don't put them like this I put them like right here, like this slanted so that the water will not go inside of here and will not destroy the bristles and I don't know why this is like this maybe it's just maybe they whenever they dry you can use it as a holder and then if you don't have any uh, makeup brushes or whatever you can use this as a, a pen holder I guess <laughs> or like that or mirror uh, scissor or tweezer if you really wanted to uh, use it you can they have a uh, 10% off I'm going to link down below every information that you wanted to know about this product and and I'm going to link everything that I uh, review for Liberex products I'm going to link it down below also and there are the skincare uh, tools if you wanted to try them out they're really good I think that's it for you guys I hope you guys like this video please give this a thumbs up and thanks for watching until next time bye